Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys for liking and sharing and subscribing to my channel. Yes, it means a lot to me guys. I'm here to do a reading for the collective here. You know, let's see what the energy is coming in here guys. Yeah? Let's see what spirits want you to know. What's coming into your life, your love life. You know, the energies that's come around, surrounding you guys. Right now. Yeah. This person that you're dealing with, what's the energies with them? Let's go, let's dive deep in, guys. Let's get some energies. Spirit guides, universal spirits, Archangel Michael, ancestors. Please show me what I need to see for the collective. Wow. So we have the strength card and the fool card here. Two major arcana and the nine of pentacles. Wow. So I see you winning here. And the strength card again. Wow. The strength card is surrounding the full card and the nine, nine of pentacles. Let me just get all these rows here out, guys. We have the three of pentacles and judgment. And the five of cups. Yeah. I should have just stopped right there. Yeah. So let me see. <coughs> The strength card, Leo energy here. We have the strength card two time here, guys. I don't know what this is for you. But I'm seeing you are so strong here. You're able to overcome something. Whatever the situation is, you overcome it. You have great strength within you here. Yeah. You conquer it, guys. You conquer it. This is your first card here. The, and between the, the, the two strength card, we have the full card. So I'm seeing a new beginning for you guys. Something new that you're about to step in here. Step through a new door. New opportunity. Doors are opening up for you. Unexpected opportunities are coming in for you. I see where you're taking a leap of faith on something here. Yeah, you're following your dreams here. Aquarius energy. So we have Leo, Aquarius, and then we have the Nine of Pentacles, which is like Taurus energy here. This is success. This is like, could have been like starting your own business here. And this is where your success, you're successful. Yeah. You're going to be able to live, you know, this luxurious lifestyle here. The life that you've been always dreaming about. This is you following your dreams. You're about to live your dreams here. Your dream life. Yeah, whatever you took a leap of faith on, this is somebody who's very strong here. You're able to overcome a lot here, guys. You have strong, you know, you know, you see this woman, she's able to tame this lion here. With her gentle spiritual powers, that brute force energy here. Yes, I'm telling you. It's trend card two time. With the lion here. It's like your, your kundalini in your body is risen here. And then we have the three of pentacles. So I'm seeing where you're collaborating with somebody. You're already successful here. You took a leap of faith on something. You could have done this alone here. Yeah, you go ahead with something here. And it paid off for you. You're successful. You're, you're in the nine of pentacles energy beautiful you like you know you're spending quality time alone here this is what you're doing i see you're going to be collaborating with other people here there's something that you're working on this could be a business you could have your own business this is it you know being self-employed being independent this is financial security you made a wake-up call here with the judgment card yeah, which is a major arcana here. The strength card, which is major arcana, two time, and the full card, and judgment. So you made a judgment call here. You're letting go of the past, past mistake, past regrets, whatever it is that was making you sad. This is somebody who is sorrowful, crying, crying over spilled milk, something that's already gone. But there's two cops standing behind you. 
you're making this judgment call here guys you're turning around you're making a new start for yourself you have overcome the situation with the strength card two times you overcome it i see you rising above the situation like a phoenix yeah rising out of the ashes here you're on fire right now you're on fire I'm telling you, it, it, this is you rising up. These people are people who like, you know, pass on for dead. They were buried and done with. That's how they see you. Yeah. But this is like a shock for them. Spirit is waking you up. Spirit is giving you everything that you need to rise above the situation. Yeah, this pettiness, whatever this is, this sadness, this crying. You're not supposed to be in this energy here. You're in the nine of pentacle energy. You're a strong warrior. A warrior queen. Yeah. Warrior queen. <laughs> The Queen of Queen of Wands definitely wanted to come out. I said Warrior Queen and she just flipped out. She flew all the way over there. Warrior Queen, there you are. So we could be dealing with a fire sign here. We have the strength card two time here. You know, Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo here. Yeah, this person is a warrior queen. You're strong here. You're powerful. This is somebody who have clairvoyant powers. You can see with this black cat in front of her throne. Psychic abilities here. I'm telling you, there's nothing that you can't overcome. You're confident. You're driven. You take action here. Inspired action. You are inspired here. I'm telling you, God is filling you up with everything that you need. With this judgment call, it's like a wake-up call for you. Waking you up here. On your true path. You're on your true path, the full card here. Now we have the, the Eight of Pentacles, Eight of Swords, the Six of Cups, Knight of Wands, Nine of Cups, Nine of Swords, and the Knight of Swords. So, from the Eight of Swords to the Nine of Swords here. I don't know why the Eight of Swords is there because the Queen of Wands is somebody who is confident here. So I don't know. This could have been somebody who is trying to make you feel, you know, not confident. When you know you, you know your power here. You know your worth. Yeah. I don't know who is this doing this to you. Or somebody's definitely feeling trapped here, but this is like an illusion of feeling trapped, guys. There's a new beginning coming in with the full card, so I don't know what this is about. We have the Six of Cups. This could be somebody from your past. I don't know. This could be an ex. Somebody's trying to keep you trapped here from moving forward towards this new beginning. This is, this is a new beginning here for you. Yeah. But something is coming in from the past here. I'm seeing somebody could also want an apology. I don't know. They're charging in here. They're taking action and they're coming towards you guys. I'm picking up on a player type energy here with this Knight of Wands. All hot and passionate here. They're charging, but they were not really serious. They could have caused you some form of mental anxiety stress this is somebody who's having sleepless night here it's with the judgment call so i'm seeing this is you making this judgment call here you're getting out of this situation here you know we have that's why we have the strength card two time here guys you have great inner strength within you harness this power within you here free yourself get out of this energy here stop expecting the worst here 
see things in a positive way. Yes, I'm telling you. Be confident in yourself. The death card. Yeah, I see you going through a transformation here with the five of cups, the death card, the, the, the knight of swords. You've gone through a transformation. There's something you're about to speak here. Yeah, there's something you have to say, guys. And you're going to say it. You're going to get it off your chest here. Yeah. This is you taking back your control, taking back your power here. With the queen of wands. I'm telling you. I'm seeing where you're getting some form of wish fulfillment here. You're feeling satisfied. You're feeling content, joy, happiness. Whatever you're working on here with this Three of Pentacles, it's definitely giving you a lot of happiness. This could be in your business. Whatever you do here, working with other people. Yeah, and we have the Eight of Wands here with this Nine of... The, 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 the Queen of Wands. So this is you could be getting like communication here. Fast moving communication here, guys. This is this is this is this could be pertaining to like you know whatever journey you're about to go on this new beginning here this is like things moving at a faster pace all the all the all the delays are over yes things are moving at a faster pace here guys this is like movement you know you're taking action action being taken here yeah events are moving at a faster pace Look at that chariot. So whatever been blocking you, whatever it is that you've been feeling trapped here, this is you taking off the blindfold and you're moving forward because you have a brand new beginning in here with the full card, which is a major arcana, also the chariot. So whatever been stopping you, whatever it is here, this is all in your head. You need to let that go. Let it go here. Move forward. It's going to take strong willpower here. Self-discipline. But this is going to be like an important achievement for you to do this. Yeah, I'm seeing you taking action here. You're moving forward. We have the King of Swords. With the Six of Cups. So I'm seeing this person definitely wants to talk to you guys. This is somebody from your past. I don't know who this person is. This, but this person wants to talk to you. They probably want to apologize. I see they're building up the confidence to approach you here. Yeah. The King of Swords, the Knight of Wands. Yeah, this person definitely want to talk to you. And they're rushing in here. Yeah, they want forgiveness. And they want you to forgive them. This is somebody who could have been very mean. Mean with their words here. They didn't want you to believe in yourself. They want you to be, to be confident. They could have been abusive with their words. Yeah, manipulative, very cold, you know, like cutthroat. There's no emotions coming from this person. And we have the Seven of Swords. So, <clears throat> I see this person. This is, this, is, this is somebody not to be trusted here. Yeah. I see where they, they, this is somebody who's trying to steal your energy, guys. They're trying to, they want to leave you depleted here, leaving you drained, you know, where you're not believing in yourself, lack of self-confidence, the seven of swords, the eight of swords, the seven of swords, this is what's going on, this is something they could be saying to you here, that making you feel this way, but you have to believe in yourself here, the queen of wands, the nine of wands, you know, you are successful here. Yeah, I'm seeing they're doing something here. They could have already done something to try to sabotage your money, your finances here. They see how happy you are, whatever it is that you're working on. Something that you're doing that, you know, make you happy, that you love. With the Nine of Cups and the Three of Pentacles. Then the Eight of Pentacles. It's, it's evolving here. But I'm seeing they're trying to cause delays here in your life. But I'm seeing where it's like unnecessary worry here, what you're worrying about, about your money, your finances here. Yeah, they could have stole, this person could have stole money from you. 
and they were hiding. They were they, they were like the way they were doing it is like they didn't want you to know. This person was being strategic, strategic, strategic. Yeah, with their plans here. They plan to steal from you. Your time, your energy, whatever it is here. And they're very cold with it. They're very cold. They don't want to see you happy. This is what it is. But I'm seeing a brand new beginning coming in for you. With the strength card two times. This is definitely telling you something here. You got the power and the strength within you here. Yeah, to close off something with the death card. Something is definitely ended here. There's something here just can't be revived here, guys. You're making this judgment call. You are the one who's rising up. And we have the Eight of Wands again. The Seven of Swords. The Seven of Pentacles. Number 77. Number 88. With the Eight of Wands two times. And the nine, the nine of cups and the nine of swords. Yeah. 77, 88, 99. It's like a row there. 77, 88, 99. 7, 8, 9. Yeah. So whatever delays they were causing, like worries. They want you to worry about money, your finances here. But I'm definitely seeing things are moving faster for you, moving at a faster pace. You're the one who's going to be like in regrets here. Yeah, they're going to be in the nine of swords energy. The five of swords again. I mean, not again, the five of swords. With the death card. This person wanted you to lose everything. That's what they did. This, whoever this king of swords is, ear sign energy, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Doesn't it have to be an ear sign? It could be just a person who is like very manipulative, very cold. You know, they're playing mind games here. They think they are so intelligent, you know, and you're so dumb. This person likes to win. And they will do any manipulative tactics to do that. But I'm seeing something has been something is shut down here. The death card, something is over. You've gone to a transformation. You're getting out of this five of cups energy here. You're letting go of the past. Whatever it is, past mistake, past regrets. You're not gonna stay in that energy anymore. You know, there's definitely a new beginning coming in for you. Yeah. The Knight of Cups, the Five of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles, Five of Swords again, High Priestess, Six of Cups, and the Ten of Swords. Wow. So I don't know what this person did here. They did a number on you guys. Hold on guys, let me go look in the kitchen. something <laughs> sorry about that guys <laughs> anyway i was saying right the five of swords the ten of swords so this person really did a number here look at that this person is like on their face here whatever they did you can see this person have like an evil grin on his face you can see it more on the other deck but they have an evil grin on their face it's just give me the creeps yeah the Ten of Swords. They really thought that you would have stayed down there. You know, the Eight of Swords. The Seven of Swords. The Nine of Swords. The Ten of Swords. The Five of Swords is like... The Five of Swords two times here. So this person is definitely... They are the problem here. They were the problem. They were posing a problem for you. From moving forward. This new beginning here. But you're strong. The first card we have is the strength card. And they then have the strength card again doubling up here. So this is you in the nine of 
pentacle energy here you're successful you're successful here you could have took your time you're alone you're spending quality time alone here you're basking in life you know you're enjoying life little luxuries this this is you following your dreams and they have a problem with that yeah they rather see you in the five of pentacles energy here where they can have control over you but you you blown past that here you gain financial stability here the four of pentacles with the nine of pentacles so from the four of pentacles the five of pentacles they really they really wanted you to have fears about your money here they want you to worry but it's unnecessary worry here i'm seeing where you have to have the you know the wisdom to accept help from others whether this is starting your own business or whatever this is you're having financial difficulties here yeah this person is a manipulator here and they really want to have control over you so you have to free yourself the ten of swords is like you've been there you've been there your back was against the wall here you were like you know feeling out not feeling you know outnumbered like see all these swords this could be people this could be people multiple of people and it's just this person here they were working with could have been working with other people yeah they wanted to see you cry they wanted to see you in the five of cups energy but whatever happened guys whatever happened it's over the 10 is a 10 this is like completion there's no more this person can throw at you they did everything that they can here they did that everything that you can you gain mental clarity you mean you know mental growth this is what it is you learn your lessons you're stronger mentally emotionally financially spiritually here this is when you connected with god you were down on your face in your darkest moment this is when you connected with god here you open up and you let god in so this is the end of this difficult situation that you were going through embrace the change that's coming in completion it's over yes i'm telling you you are the high priestess here you have intuitive knowledge here hidden knowledge that they didn't know they didn't know that you are wise you're a wise person you get like downloads from spirit Pisces energy here yeah they did something here you see this evil grin on their face they did something and I see this person was like these people were walking this person is crying this whoever this person is they lay down their swords they're crying here it's like they want you to give up they wanted you to give up here but you didn't you didn't give up you get stronger that's why we have the strength card two times you got stronger here but the queen of wands you're very confident in yourself you're driven here there's no way they could stop you you are a warrior a spiritual warrior here okay let me get another roll here let's see what's coming in else yeah the eight of cups so you see what i mean you walked away with the knight of cups to the eight of cups you feel good walking away this is something you wanted to do there's a desire in you to walk away yes guys there's a calling in you to you going towards something more meaningful in your life which is going to give you emotional and spiritual growth Then we have the two of cups wow this is what you're moving towards here i'm seeing a soulmate connection here guys yeah you're walking away from all these cups you know one point they might have given you happiness i don't know in the beginning but it's not anymore it's not anymore it's not working out it's not giving you any more happiness so you're going towards whatever making you happy here and i'm seeing
this could be new love here a new connection where this yeah this relation both of you like growing closer the knight of swords yeah you guys could be learning about each other here the knight of swords it could be dealing with an ear sign a water sign yeah somebody's watching i don't know watching spying here and these two people yeah the wheel of fortune so i'm seeing like a sudden turn of event here whatever what what they did here guys what they did here they did something i was watching to wait to see how things were going to work out we're going to yeah but fortune only fall in your lap here guys the wheel of fortune turned in your favor here not in their favor they wanted to see change for the worse for you the nine of sword they were like expecting the worst of you but it didn't happen here that's why they like this that's why they're in this energy here they can't believe that it's the you know what they did all what they did here all what they did it didn't work they took action on you but they find out that you are a powerhouse you're strong yep you're strong both spiritually so when they send their evil attack here, whatever it is they send, it couldn't it couldn't touch you. You're like a brick wall here. You're like a brick wall. It's time for a positive change in your life here. I'm seeing love is coming in. Whatever you're moving towards, you walk away from something, and you're going towards love. And this is this is like spirit changing this for you. This is like your destiny that you're moving towards here. I see you guys are learning about each other. We have the King of Wands. So now we have the King of Wands and the Queen of Wands. Yeah, the Queen of the King of Wands is with the High Priestess here. The Queen of Wands is with the Strength card here. Yeah, so so this King of Wands, he's, he's spiritually strong here, guys. This person is a spiritual warrior. Also the Queen of Wands, she's strong. She's very strong here. She She's like... She have control here. She took back her power. And both of these people coming together, you guys going to be like a powerhouse. There's nothing that you can't overcome with this trend card two time here, guys. Whether whether this is in your business, you know, in your personal life, yeah. You guys are growing closer here. This love, this connection. It's a very intense, passionate connection here, guys, for both of you. This king of... King of Wands intuitively know that you're the one that they love here. You make this person feel happy. They feel good. And I see where they want to work with you. They want to team up with you. They've been dreaming about you guys. They're very focused on you right now. I see this person could have been watching you from a distance. <laughs> yeah, they could have been watching you from a distance. They're very focused on you. And there's something that they're planning here. They want to achieve this with you. Something they want to achieve with you. They want to be closer to you. Yeah. The chariot, again. So you see what I mean? They want to move forward. This could be like a, definitely a soulmate connection here. You're going to be getting communication from this person. A phone call, text messages. For sure, you're going to be hearing from this person. It's an important achievement here to have with you guys. Both of you are going to be moving forward here. You already came out of this difficult situation. There's nothing more that this person can do. They tried everything. They tried, oh my God, they tried everything. You see what I mean? The devil and the ten of wands. There's nothing more that they can't do here. They really wanted you down here, guys. They didn't want you to believe in yourself here. All this fire that they, they, they sent at you, towards you. They could have even been sending like demonic enti entities here. Watching you. Trying to make sure that you have trouble. Try to make sure you have problem. Try to make sure you have stress. Try to make sure that you're not happy. Oh my god. It's two cards here. They're watching you. They've been watching you here. Watching you suffer. Watching you going through your pain. But that's the end of it. The Ten of Swords. The Ten of Wands. 
they wanted control over you you see how these two people are chained to the devil here this could be two people doing this here this you see how those cards just flipped out guys the eight of cups but you walk away from them you walk away from this you walk away from all these burdens here whatever this was this could have even been like a contract a wedding contract you could have been married to this person i don't know guys but this was a lot of pressure it was a lot to bear i'm seeing this could have been like 10 days 10 years 10 months i don't know it was a long time here but you got out of it that's what i'm seeing here you're moving towards your dream here you're dreaming yeah and you're gonna be well off here you're gonna be successful guys i'm telling you let's get three angel message here let's see what more spirits want you to know yeah there's a brand new beginning coming in you overcome whatever this person tried to do to you guys this devil yeah and i'm seeing where this king of swords has something to do with it this is somebody from your past something from something from your past it has to do with money here they could have stole money from you they want money from you but it's not happening here you're finding your freedom you're finding your independence the dreamer the card is in reverse which is the full card see what i mean so this devil was trying to stop your new beginning they didn't want you to have this new beginning guys oh my god they wanted to keep you under pressure here with this ten of swords you have to know what this is for yourself they wanted to keep you under pressure they wanted to keep you on a wrap they didn't want no opportunity to come in towards you they didn't want to see you take no leap of faith they didn't want to see you follow your dreams life experience but i'm seeing a significant event life event changing event about to happen here that this devil can't stop a powerful you're getting a powerful revelation here spirit could be showing you who this person is this devil and it's it, it's definitely going to lead to a change for you yeah you're going to see guys you're getting a powerful revelation that's going to lead to change it's time for you to spread your wings and fly the king of pentacles it's time for you to spread your wings and fly this is where you're supposed to be successful yeah from the nine of pentacles the king of pentacles you're supposed to be successful here it's a successful time for you so they can't stop it whatever this is something significant about to happen in your life which is going to change everything it's going to change everything here they can't stop your new beginning here they're fighting they're trying they're doing a lot here they're doing a lot but you have the Midas touch here or whoever this person is coming in you could be dealing with an earth sign here this king of pentacles this is a successful business person here yeah this person could have also have a lot of money for themselves the entrepreneur they have gone through a transformation here they know who they are they're grounded they're stable they're generous i'm telling you this is somebody who is responsible here All right, let me get an oracle here guys let me get some oracles for you we want to stop your new beginning oh my god you can't do this spirit is coming in guys whatever is going to change here grief so you see they want you to be in grief they want you to lose the bull card in reverse they want you to lose everything really sad though how desperate some people can get they're grieving here or they want you to be grieving but you see what it is it is your fate that's why this change is happening here with the wheel of fortune life experience this is like the wheel of fortune the life experience so we have in the wheel of fortune two time with your fate guys this is why things are changing in your favor i'm telling you you get out of that difficult time here it's time for you to spread your wings and fly your fate is moving mountain the obstacles whatever it is here 
you're breaking down barriers here they can't stop you they can't stop you it's gonna drive them crazy here i'm telling you when they see all this whoever this person is somebody who is materialistic it's all about vanity it's all about money that's why they're doing it they're doing it here they want to have control over you yeah guilt so they want either they want you to feel guilty or this person is feeling guilty here you see somebody is like in a in a, in a handcuff here this is what they want they want you to stay chained to them so they can have you to use you walk all over you but they're feeling guilty here this yeah they're feeling guilty because abundance is coming in guys this is like the universal showing down upon you blessings this is like an inflow of abundance coming in for you they can't stop this your prayers your prayer guys you keep the faith and you pray and you're afraid your prayer was answered it's breaking barriers you're breaking chains whatever they think they had over you they got another thing coming. They can't they can't match up with the power of God. They can't match up with that. Yeah, they have to think twice. Yeah. I'm telling you, something about to happen here with this life experience card with this King of Pentacles. This person is coming in, guys. You don't even have to look. This person gonna find you. This person's trying to keep you trapped here. But the strength card, the full card. They can't stop you. They can't stop you. I'm telling you. Okay, guys. End of your reading. I hope this reading resonates with you. If it did, please give me that thumbs up, guys. Much appreciated. You know, take care of your beautiful self out there, guys. Yes? Love and light.